Hey guys, what's going on? I got another new product we're going to be trying today. This is one of those uh, grab bag ones that I purchased the other week. Um, it's the Turtle Wax Ice Premium Care Interior Cleaner and Protectant. Uh, we're going to be using it on my 2001 Honda Prelude. It just got washed yesterday and I never got to the inside, so this will be a good day to test it out. Uh, the inside is actually pretty dirty. I haven't actually cleaned the interior in probably about a month or so now. And I love to drive with my windows down, so it gets very dusty in here, okay? Um, you see the inside is actually pretty dirty and like I said, in a month is how quickly this thing gets dirty. Now, uh, I'm inside the car as you can tell, but um, I hope you can see this. Do you see the dust layer already? I'm going to put my hand across it. Do you see that? See that line in there? Because I love to ride with the windows down. The air conditioning works in here, but I'm just one of those guys I always like to have it down or have the sunroof up, open, you know, that kind of thing. So, I'm going to go ahead and try cleaning up the interior today, give this product a test out, and then uh, I'll let you know how I feel. I heard a lot of you guys recommend it, so once again, I'm listening to your advice and trying this product out. Um, you guys tell me it's not a really shiny product, like an armor all or something, and uh, so we'll find out here in a second. So, stand by. I'm going to actually do it inside the garage because, as you know, it's a beastly hot day here in Florida. We're back to the heat again, and uh, I think it's like 90 degrees today. It's great sun tan weather, but I've already been outside washing my red car, and I'm just, it's already burning up, so I'm going to take it inside to finish the interior. So stand by here, I'll pull it in the garage, and then uh, we'll show us clean it. Alright, take care. Alright guys, here we go. We got the microfiber towel down, because I'm actually going to use it to spray on it normally. Of course, I'd hold it and just spray on it, but holding the camera, obviously, I need to make sure I have it. So here you go, the spray. It actually recommends you to spray it straight into a microfiber towel, or it says you can actually directly spray it, but I'm going to tell you right now, uh, if you wanted to look, make it look professional without having to overspray on any of the glass or anything up there, you always want to spray it directly onto here, so that way you're just wiping where you want to wipe it. You're not just randomly just spraying down your glass. That is a pain in the tail to have to clean up all that uh, mess. Uh, it's also good if you spray on here when you go onto the gauges. You don't want to spray directly onto the gauges because then if it gets up underneath it, it's actually going to can get up there and fog it up. Another pain in the tail you do not want to have to deal with, okay? Because in order to get that cleaned up properly, you're going to have to take the whole thing off in order to get behind the glass. So don't mess with it. Always spray it on here. And then uh, when, we're, when I go to actually dry it off, I'll flip it over to the other side here. And I'll go ahead and uh, wipe it with the other side. So let's see what we got here. Let me go ahead and uh, spray it down real quick. Come on. So you can just liberally spray it on there. I'm not too, too worried about how much I'm putting on there, okay? I'm just going to work my way all the way across. Get it all the way in there good. I don't want to miss anything. Alright, uh, the smell of it reminds me of, uh, right now, what do I want to say? It's a type of cleaning product, but I honestly can't put it. It's, it's almost um, a smell of a rug type cleaning product. I, I can't, it's the only way I can describe it, okay? It smells like, a, you know, when you clean your rugs in your house or whatever. That's what it smells like, okay? Um, as you can see, there is really no shine here at all. I'm, I'm really getting it in there. I really want to get in there and do it right. There's no shine here at all. So it's just going to be a nice, clean look when it's done, okay? You see how I flipped that over to come back across and wipe any of the residue off? So, yeah. I mean, it smells fine. There's nothing wrong with it, but uh, it's not like a, a sweet smell. It's just a carpet cleaning smell. That's how I can properly describe it. When somebody steams, cleans your carpet or whatever, or you have like a rug stain, that's what this stuff smells like. So let me go ahead and finish up the interior of the car. I'll show you the results. I'll back back out of the garage and I'll show you the results. But so far, I mean, not a bad job. It's not going to shine. It's, uh, it said it's a protection you against UV and stuff like that. So um, if you're looking for something that's going to shine, obviously you're not going to want to try this product. There's other products out there, Meguiar's Armor, all that kind of thing is going to have. Uh, a shine factor to it. But if you want the clean look, this is definitely the way to roll. Let me go ahead and finish this thing up and um, I'll go ahead and show you the results. Stay tuned. Alright guys, welcome back. Here's going to be the final results of the Turtle Wax Ice Premium Care Interior Cleaner and Protectant. Um, thank you guys first of all for recommending this stuff. I have uh, now tried it and I've showed you me using it. Uh, it's just as you guys quoted. Um, you said there was going to be not a lot of shine. You can see right away. There is not a lot of shine. Personally, I do like a lot of shine on my Hondas. That's just me. But my 370Z has a different type of material up here. So uh, it doesn't reflect the shine very good. So I like the natural look for it. So for future use, I will only use that this product inside my uh, Nissan. Now, a lot, now I know a lot of you guys only like the natural shine. You don't want a shiny. And there's nothing wrong with that. Everybody has their own personal taste. But at least this way, I got to see what it was. I could try it out. And I got to, you know, I listened to you guys and... 
I'm glad I did because then I got to see a, a new product for myself. So thank you very much for all the recommendations here. I always try to listen to my audience, so I hope that helps you out. Well, thank you very much for uh, recommending this. You can see it's all the dust is full, totally gone. I hope you liked it. I hope you like uh, that I'm trying out stuff that you recommend. And uh, please take time to like it and remember to subscribe. And I will see you guys in a little bit. Later.